the network. Two thousand seventeen, two thousand eighteen, two thousand nineteen. Yeah, three years. I was in LA for three years. Mm -hmm. um, I just didn't like it, man. I didn't like the city. Uh, all of my connections were happening online, so the city wasn't doing anything for me. Mm -hmm. um, and like, I'm freelance. Like, I don't drive to work. Like, I'm sitting in front of my computer like making beats all day and, and whatever. So I'm, I'm at home. Well, it's just doing harm for me that I have to pay way more rent living out here in LA when I could be way less stressed and still be doing what I love to do and still be getting all the opportunities I'm getting through the internet if I lived elsewhere, you know? So I moved out, I moved to Michigan. Um, I might end up in Chicago, might end up in New Jersey. I don't know. I don't know where I'll end up. But for now, I'm in Michigan, and I'm saving money, and I feel great because I get to, you know, just do what I love to do and blah, blah, blah. When I was in L.A., like I said, I wasn't getting any opportunities, okay, when I was living here. The people that I was hitting up that I knew in L.A., they were, I said, yo, I moved to L.A. Let's link up sometime, you know? Like whoever the person is, a big shot guy, um, a friend, anyone. Yeah, let's do it sometime, right? Well, I'm here visiting LA right now for three weeks, okay? Yo, I'm here for, uh, I'm here for three weeks. Let's link up. You want to make music? You want to, like, I, action, I can actually tell them, you want to make music, like, straight up to their face? And they're like, oh, my God, yeah, we got to link up before you leave. Dude, I've been getting the most opportunities this three weeks than I've ever gotten in the past fucking three years. I was in L.A., you know? Yeah. Such a weird city, man. But um, it makes you, sense, right? Yeah, you create urgency. It's like a sales funnel, man. It's like, yeah. act or not, and then I'm going to be gone. The, the opportunity is gone. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and in my opinion, and I always tell this to everyone, it's cheaper to visit LA I mean I guess depending where you're flying from but for the plane ticket cost but it's cheaper to visit LA than to actually live there when you break down the expenses because the cost of rent which is a big chunk of it is so high um but also you know when you live here you gotta have a you have to have a car have to or else you're gonna go broke through Uber um and the car expenses are really expensive. Like it's trying to four fifty a gallon for gas. Um, oil changes are ex everything's more expensive. Oil changes are like a hundred bucks. Um, like tires, everything, everything's expensive. Insurance is out the way, like out to lunch. Insurance is out to lunch. I'm talking car insurance, medical insurance. Um, groceries are expensive. Like groceries are just like way more money out here for some reason um and i just thought to myself like dude i could pay way less living out somewhere else and then if i visit and i'm creating urgency i mean that's that's the best and because i know people out here i can i have a place to stay you know that's that's always good um yeah i think if you know people in la or try to try that's my advice that's my advice to all the producers out there. If you are, or, or producers or, or rappers or anyone in the music industry, network with everyone you know in LA. If you really want to try to get shit happening in LA, network with everyone you know in LA, if you live out of state. Um, and then when the time is right, you, hopefully you have a place to stay, go there for a week, hit up all the people that you, uh, you know, we're networking with create that urgency hey i'm here for a week if, week if you want to link up man if you establish good relationships over the internet i mean hands down they're gonna be like oh he's in town let's go link up whatever dude one time my friend um who's a like a he's a, he's a famous rapper I, I really wanted to make music with him sometime this one week 
he's like, bro, I can't. My friend, my friend's in town, um, and I really want to see her like before she heads back to Toronto. This girl's like a she has a successful like fashion uh, company and stuff, and and she has like a blog and everything like that. And she, when she came to LA, she had so much good content she made. She was with this guy, and you know they had all this good stuff going and. And I'm and I'm fucking living here, and I'm like, man, I can't even get a single uh, day out of this guy to uh, make a song. And then a week after, the guy went to Europe. I'm like, motherfucker, you know? But that's, you know, like if I visited, um, if I visited you in Atlanta, or I'm sorry, if I visited Atlanta and I told you, hey, I'm here for a week, I'm sure you would try to find time out of your week to be like, I want to see if this week I can find time to see. Danny, like that's the simple thought that you have in your head. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's. I mean, it's a it's a strategy yeah. that doesn't get used or pushed at all. And I think everything you're saying, especially right. when you have money coming in and it's coming in through the internet, not the location that you're in. Stop being married right. to the. Don't stop being married to this dream you've been sold that this location will solve the problem for right. you. Right. And you're still getting the income, and now you can lower the the uh, what is it? The quality of life or the income needed for a quality of life. So now it's less stress. Yeah. You can market yourself more with the extra money, or do whatever you want to do for the extra money. Right. Reinvest in the business, all that stuff. So it it makes all the sense in the world. Then you get the benefit of people actually working with you when you act when they can. And they go. So exactly. I mean, we live in the fucking future now. Like, let's take advantage of it. You don't need to live in LA. LA is land of opportunity. LA is a city of opportunity. Okay. And so is Chicago and so is New York and so is Atlanta and Miami and London. You yeah. know? Why would you uh live in LA when you can just visit? And you can still get probably six months worth of scram like scattered meetings into three weeks why wouldn't you do that you know that's what i'm thinking I mean, we got planes we got the internet there's nothing else to worry about you don't need to it's the network